before starting the installation, let's take a look at some of the main accessories. Step 1. LED Cabinet and Bracket Installation First, we place the LED cabinet on the level ground and connect them through the quick locks on both sides. During installation, make sure someone supports the LED cabinet to prevent it from falling. Then we install the LED cabinet on the rear bracket, align the two holes under the connecting plate with the LED cabinet holes, screw in the connecting plate screws, and the fixation is completed. Continue to install the LED cabinets. And also install the rear brackets between the third and fourth LED cabinets. Continue to install the first row of LED cabinets, paying attention to installing a rear bracket between every two LED cabinets to keep them fixed. Next, install the second row of LED cabinets. The two rows of LED cabinets can be fixed through the clip locks on the upper and lower sides. Put the second LED cabinet in. After locking the quick locks on the sides and bottom, fix it on the connection. Then use screws to secure it to the bracket. Continue to install the second row of LED cabinets and repeat the process just now. Then install the third row of LED cabinets. Next, we will increase the height of the rear bracket, align the holes of the two brackets, screw in the bracket screws, and tighten them with a wrench. Next, install the fourth row. After locking the two LED cabinets, Align the two holes under the connecting plate with the holes in the LED cabinet, and screw in the screws to connect it to the second layer bracket. Repeat the steps just now to install and fix the fourth row on the second layer brackets.
The same operation is used to install the fifth row. After locking the quick locks on both sides of the LED cabinet, screw in the screws to connect it to the second layer bracket. Repeat the steps just now to install and fix the fifth row on the second layer of brackets. Step 2. Connect the LED screen video processor. Insert the signal cable into the lower interface of the LED cabinet, and insert the other end into the lower interface of another LED cabinet. Plug in the first row in sequence, and then plug in the signal cables in the second, third, fourth, and fifth rows, respectively. Next is the power cord. Align the yellow plug with the yellow interface and the black plug with the black interface. Connect the power cords of the first, second, third, fourth and fifth rows in sequence. Next, we connect the video processor. We connect one end of the main signal line to the video processor. One row of LED cabinets corresponds to one interface with a total of five rows. The other end of the main signal line is inserted into the signal interface on the left side of the LED cabinet. Then connect the main power cord to the power interface on the left side of the LED cabinet. We connect the right side of the LED cabinet with a power cord with black plugs at both ends. Step 3. Configure LED screen. Insert the USB flash drive, open Nova LCT, click user, click advanced synchronous system user login, enter the default password, click screen configuration, click next. Click receiving card. Click load from PC, open the configuration file we prepared. After successful loading, click to send parameters to the receiving card. After success is displayed, click save to complete the configuration, 